Lumos, Accio, Depulso, 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 Expulso, 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 Levioso, 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 Protego, 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 Lumos, Defindo, 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 Confringo, 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 Descendo. This looks promising. Ah, there you are. So, shall we proceed? Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule is... To think it was beneath us all this time. A map. There's Hogsmeade. And over here, the Forbidden Forest. And, of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. And what could this be? If only you were here to see this. Don't need to tell you how dangerous goblins can be. Best stay close. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Oh. Oh, dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. It may take some time. I was hoping to see you. Oh. And don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Uh, hmm. They've got this. Uh, you need to contain it. Uh, uh, mm, mm. You are stronger than you know. <sighs> the wizarding world could not be in more capable hands. That's our way forward. The wand! Quickly! This is a test. Over here. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. It will take more than that to get to me. My agility belies my years, wouldn't you say? Come now. I've no time for nonsense. This is utterly uncalled for. Ah! I trust that was an accident. Godric's heart. I'm on fire! Oh, for for a spot of... Sunshine. Sh just like an Antarctica. You forced my wand. It's a shame it had to come to this. This is a length I'd hope not to go to. Why would you do such a thing? That conduct is most unbecoming of a student. Most annoying. One must use whatever resources one has available in combat, even if that means vegetation. It's not every day one sees flora put to such use. Oh, my ears! Godric's heart! I've had quite enough of this. I hope this will have satisfied your desire for foolishness. What's going on? Merlin's beard! I thought it'd never end. I'll never get used to that sound. That outfit is most unseemly. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Finally, Minister Spavin talks more than he listens, ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Rotten roast beef? You found the pages. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which, his great niece. He did, did he? Scrope sent you messages? You went to Azkaban? What do you mean, statues? In the Owlery? Why would you want to take toast? You met the Headless Hunt? <laughs> that must have been interesting to say the... Is that a... It is. I believe I know what must be done. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a grap horn will somehow open the way forward. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next? I can't say. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. I have, yes. Years ago, at Stonehenge, of all places. The Ministry still owes me for that favour. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. We could 
but we've no idea what's in the tower. Oh, I'm glad that's over. I'd wager this mess is the fault of time, not goblins. How on earth could they have known about this place? Looks like we found the entrance. This place could do with a bit of pruning. Let's look around. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. You're here. I have good news. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. It can be difficult, of course. They are massive, after all. But it's not impossible. Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I wonder. Follow my lead. Someone's coming. With robes like that, it could be anyone. George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. After you. Just barely. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Wait! We do not know... Akio! And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Thank you for your help. I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... What happened? Are you all right? Phineas. Nigellus. Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. It appears to be a fearsome beast known as a Graphorn. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of Graphorns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. Certainly. You're to find and subdue a Graphorn that lives nearby. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. I suspected you would see something. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. This will direct you anywhere you wish to go. A classroom, the Great Hall, or... Should you ever require it, somewhere in the Hogwarts dungeons. Unfold it and have a look. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. You access the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this jackdaw get the pages from the book? I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful, dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. I know that, Tower. It's not far. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. We shall defer to you in this matter, of course. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. <clears throat> Are you all right? You're hurt. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. <clears throat> Precisely. Oh, yes, of course. Stay close. Like the clue you saw on the porky container? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Astonishing traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... Ranrock. I'm not giving you anything. Are you all right? 
I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. It's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must say I... Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start-of-term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. A new student? It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Miriam? How? That she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. I don't see a glow. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? There were complications. It seems the goblin problem has... Shall we have a look? Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Heard of it? Miriam's wand. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent! A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way, Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Ah, up there. What, in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. I don't believe it. Almost there. Ripero! Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. This may have been his home. I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems... Out of place. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your wand works improving with every cast. Steady yourself! That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Lumos! Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. Try casting Revelio, perhaps. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Well done. When was the last time this vault was accessed? Until then. Be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. The tower on the map, north of Hogsmeade. I'll scout things out ahead. Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. 
Best head inside, stealthy as you can. Many goblins have always been antagonistic towards wizard kind, but this is different somehow. I've known my share of goblins, but have never known any so aggressive. How have the goblins come to be so misguided? It's a sad day, really. Their blood is on Ranrock's hands. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? What room? I don't see anything. Another pensive. Godric's heart. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What is it? Look out! Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. If our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. Perhaps we are only after a book. But we should be prepared for anything. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. I imagine these brooms have been enchanted for centuries. Never seen an enchantment last this long. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe. Has something changed? He knew Miriam? Incredible. All right, you'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. He is, so you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing, a polyjuice potion. You'll look and sound like Professor Black. One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my fruitless trip to the ministry on his behalf. Now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain more. Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Why those memories? Hmm, perhaps this book will explain. I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But we have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. It seems we have no choice but to wait, frustrating as it is. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit, before we continue. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. I assume you have news regarding the goblin you mentioned. Why don't we meet at the map chamber to discuss that and our next steps? There you are. What did you learn? Over here! Ah, oh, up there! That's our way in! We already knew they were after you, but now we know they're digging for stores of magic. This must be it. The store of magic and the source of Ranrock's power. Ranrock said there's more to be found, and if he's right about that, it may or may not be located here. I would join you if I could. I shall await your arrival in the map chamber. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well, and we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. We should focus on what's ahead. Let's keep moving. This way. Ready to proceed? We should move on. Let's keep moving. We're close now. It's just ahead. I'm not sure this mural is going to give us many answers. What did you foresee? Certainly an odd place to build a home. You seem to have caused the floor to change. Stay close. Are you there? This way! Lead the way. That's it. There you are. Good. Keep at it. It's important that you learn this. Once more. Again. You'll get it. Well done. It's working. Be ready for anything. For now, tell me what you saw in the pensive. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, according to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. Godric's heart! Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me, 
Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. I knew it would. I may have done too good a job distracting Black. I had no idea he can't hold his fire whiskey. Godric's heart, are you all right? I know you're well able to defend yourself. I've seen it often enough. But Rookwood himself. We can only hope that we're not too late, and that we find nothing but a repository undisturbed beyond this door. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you, they will in the future. I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. Damn, the goblins! If his loyalists are here, he cannot be far behind. These tunnels haven't brought us much luck so far. More of Ranrock's damn loyalists! Ranrock's plan will fail! We need to press on. Ranrock must be here somewhere. I shall handle it. One moment. Let's go. Doesn't sound like a drill. Troll! You fought one of these in Hogsmeade? I see it. And I don't know. I can only hope they arrive soon. A dead end. Now what? Very perceptive, my young friend. Ranrock must be getting closer to finding the repository. Listen, more goblins up ahead. They must be on their way, but we can't stop now. It looks as if they've been here for a while. They've even brought explosives. You fiends don't know what you're doing. Ranrock sending you on his fool's errand. You won't succeed. Now that that's settled, let's move on. This way. It worked. Let's go. Thank you, Professor. Time to move. We're in the thick of it now. Stop him! I'm relieved we got here before Ranrock. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils. Whatever that may be. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Where is that portrait? You would be wise not to underestimate this student. Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen. And I've been teaching a long time. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. I see. Ranrock clearly knows even more than we suspected. Why am I not surprised? shall we? And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I heard what you told Professor Bacar. Isadora was inhaling emotions to gain power? Monstrous. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Speak to Professor Rackham at once. We've no time to lose. I'd like to have a look around. <sighs> Wait, let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. I do. But to what end, I can't say. What statue? Hello? Are you there? Yes. Godric's heart, I'm glad you're all right. I'm somehow back in the entry room to the vault. Oh, peeves. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip to the Ministry, hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. That said, be careful. I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the Ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. Oh? Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Of course. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? The map is enchanted to help you find your way. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now... Focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Very handy. 
No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. Hmm. The tower has clearly not been maintained. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. Or I suppose we could charge right into their mist. Oh. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. Goblin Silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... Yes, yes. You believe he can be trusted? Very well. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? Well, that's something, I suppose. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? You have been busy. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. I suppose that's the quick way down. Is there something to those symbols on the walls? Goblin tracks. They're a step ahead of us. Let's see where they lead. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What? That's... Wait. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spellcasting. Move a bit closer and try again. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of, and she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No. I dare say, after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. How do you feel? Quickly now, stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalus. Go on, cast Petrificus Totalus. No time like the present for a full body bind curse. Well done. It's going to take more than that to stop him. I will be honest. I've no idea where to start. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. An intricate carving. I'll study this for a moment. Hang on! Give me your hand! The key! Now then, that there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. These orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? And why here? There must be something. I'll keep looking over here. Professor Rookwood was right. The place is crawling with Victor Rookwood's lot and Ranrock's loyalists. They're working together, all right. But it is not a friendly alliance. I'm sure you'll agree that we need to find a way in other than the front gate. Let's go. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. After everything you've seen, what about Isadora's fate? I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking, but this could go wrong in so many ways. You, of all wizard kind, are wholly aware of the potential cost. You cannot possibly mean that. You, of all wizard kind, are wholly aware of the misery and pain that that could cause. I understand, but you are not entirely alone. I will do all I can to help you. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. Hmm? Jump! You may have seen it yourself. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> I don't know what to say. 
she could win over almost anyone. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. Where is the next trial? Incredible. Very well. You'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. It does? The repositories. Five names. The Keepers and who else? Isadora Morganac? If the Keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us to more information. Astonishing. Well done. Their numbers are dwindling. This is the last of them. For now. One down, one to go. We almost have it. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. Of course, the bad news is that it's likely because they no longer need to track the Keepers for information. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. It's my experience that many of your spells will have no real effect. You'll need to wear him down. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed you. And why are you here? What do you intend to do with it? Oh! Oh. Oh. Not with this much armor, they don't. I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I'm relieved to hear that. I know the power is tempting but I'm glad you've decided to keep it contained for now. And whilst that may be the right decision in this moment, I confess I have been thinking... <coughs> Miriam, Miriam, would have loved you, my young friend. Late rising today, were we? No time to change? I don't know Miss Onai well, as she's only been with us a hair longer than you have. But she seems a bright and talented witch. Miss Sweeting's on the reserve side, isn't she? However, I have noticed how she blossoms when beasts are around. Charming young man, Mr. Sallow. Little mischievous, but a talented wizard nonetheless. Mr. Takar seems a well-focused young man. Good to see you found a friend in him. You're not likely to meet as keen a flyer as Miss Ray's. If you've the metal for broom flight, she's an excellent resource. I'd imagine Mr. Clopton is an entertaining companion, if his escapades in class are any indication. Let's not travel that path at the moment, shall we? Careful now. If the rumours are to be believed, you've taken to increasing the beast population. Where do you find the time? Still baffling to me that such a book was hidden in the restricted section all these years. Shouldn't be surprised to have found a map chamber under the castle. Merlin knows what else is hidden here. I'd seen Bacar's tower countless times. Never suspected it held the secrets it did. <laughs> to this day, I get a chuckle every time I picture you as Professor Black thanking me. Bit distracted, are we? Now... The field guide can be used to guide you to the location you've marked on your map. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. You are now the keeper of whatever power it holds. Miriam was right. And the second memory? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. You're right. He wouldn't have stopped. You did what you had to do. 
With Harlow in custody and Rookwood gone, the wizarding community owes you a great debt. You're right. He wouldn't have stopped. You did what you had to do. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. You're right. You had no choice. You did what you had to do. With Harlow in custody and Rookwood gone, the wizarding community owes you a great debt. You're right. You had no choice. You did what you had to do. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. All right, then. The keepers have been waiting. 